Yeah, today the powerful House Labor Committee made its recommendation on Senate Bill 11, which is right to work. After a lengthy public hearing, the committee recorded, recommended to effectively kill the bill just ahead of next week's vote in the House. As it usually does, the issue drew a large crowd to Concord, majority pro-union folks. But the testimony was made today on both sides and from a number of different angles. But in the end, organized labor came away with the result that it was looking for. I think it's very important that we do not adopt this law. We benefit in New Hampshire from having unions that can negotiate freely, um, where workers can talk freely with their employers about negotiating these types of terms. As far as what it means for the state of New Hampshire, I think we just have to look at what's happened in other states. And if we become the only state in the Northeast that has right to work, this will be a positive for New Hampshire's employees and employers. Now, despite today's negative recommendation, next week's vote in the House is expected to be extremely close as a number of Republicans still not sold on the merits of right to work, but there is a lot of phone calls being made. A no vote would be a bitter pill, though, for supporters as it has already passed the Senate and Governor Sununu has publicly stated that he'll sign it into law should it make it to his desk. But before that happens, obviously, there is one more steep hill to climb. Reporting live, Josh McKelvin, WMUR News 9.